Hello everybody, today we will be doing another tutorial video, but this time on Umbara, and this is how to get on top of the Republic uh, Venator up here. I'm not sure if you can see me pointing at it, but it's actually not as hard as you think it is, but it does require a little bit of patience. So once again, you do need a mount. I always suggest a staff because the staff jumps the highest. And there is an interesting little statue up there on top of that Venator, because I think... Uh, Malik Plasma Owl, I think I'm saying his name right, was the first one to discover how to get up there. I didn't see anybody do a video on how to get up there, maybe I just missed it somewhere, but... So just pretty much follow what I'm doing here, just go up here, and once you get over here to where I'm hovering my mouse at, I'm not sure if you can see it, but if you don't, it's this little bit, what I call the dead tree thing here, where you have to jump up it with a stap. And once you jump up it with a step, then you will have to go on one of the, as I call it, one of the branches. One of the dead branches. And then once you manage to get up on one of the branches, it will push you out of the way to where you can explore the out of bounds area, because you can't travel to it. So you have to go up this branch right here, as I, once again I call it a branch. Not sure what you want else want to call it. So. It looks easy, but it's taken me quite a few times to actually do this to where I have to balance my way up here because I've screwed myself over quite a few times, like like that is a prime example. And then once you get high enough, you can just go past the invisible wall, and here you are. You are now in the out-of-bounds area. And then you have to go up one of these branches on this dead tree, as I just like to call it. And I will show you which one that is, just gotta jump over here, make sure I get the jump right. Alright, good, good, good. And now, you would have to go up this branch, uh, right here. The really fat looking one. Well, then again, they all look fat, so maybe that doesn't help you too much. Then you will see what I have to do here. I can't jump anymore, so I have to go over here and do this. Still jumping on my way up, and then I have to go back over on this side to jump up. Now, will I get this on my first try? Probably not, but you will get the general idea of what I'm trying to do here. Yep, see? See what I mean? Like, I almost fell all the way down, but I keep, uh, forgetting to bounce this out to where you have to jump all the way to the top here. Like, you see this red thing I'm jumping on here, this, like, red little light... You have to jump all the way to the top here. And then once you get to the top, you jump, you turn around, and then you get on top of this huge structure. I don't even know what to call it. I can't really call it a tree, because it's not really a tree. And then once that happens, you can just jump up here and travel your way up on to this little branch. And then yes, you do have to do some more jumping. And then once you're on up here, just be very careful. Jump, go forward, and done. All good to go. And uh, there is the uh, statue here of, uh, as I said, I think this is of Malik Plasma Owl. Let me see if I can uh, do this correctly. Yep, there is his statue. Looks pretty cool. Anyways, I will show you the view over here. And you could do like a little Assassin's Creed thing and just do a little leap of faith if you wish. Very, very high up, and I'm not sure if you get the, like, the weird vertigo where you're jumping down and you feel like you're jumping down with it. So that concludes this video of how to get on the Venator cruiser up there. Thank you all for watching, and goodbye.